Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that internet interruption. Praying that this works out better. So I'm sure some of you will see that there is now going to be a second video um, for our oils and emotions class. So I will continue on. If there's anything you missed, these videos will be saved for the replay. So feel free to tag your friends, your members, your family so that they can join on in. Okay, so we are continuing off the first video had some issues with um, volume and my voice being choppy. So this should be better. Okay, so we are going to talk about first off, what are essential oils? Most people don't even maybe know what essential oils are. So essential oils actually come from plants. Um, they're the liquid or the oil that comes from the plant, either the um, stem, the branches, fruits, flowers, seeds, bark, roots, leaves, all sorts of things like that. They're steam distilled, or if it's a fruit, it's cold pressed from the rind of that fruit. Essential oils contain hundreds and or thousands of naturally occurring compounds that make up that specific plant. Um, the plants essential to life, like the essential oil in the plant is essential for it to be alive. They carry nutrition to the plant, they carry waste out, they regulate the plant function, so the essential oil in the plant regulates the plant function, it helps produce vitamins, enzymes that the plants need, it protects the plants from disease as well as insects, protects the plants from sunburn, dehydration, hot climate, and so much more. So why should we use them? Well, the coolest thing is it, when used on people, it can actually provide us many of those same benefits. So how do you use oils? The first and very common way is aromatically. So aromatically as I have it in the diffuser here, it's diffusing and I'm breathing it in the air. Another way to do it aromatically is to take an essential oil, apply a couple drops into your palm of your hand, and then you have oil, you can rub it around, cup it over your nose and mouth and take deep breaths. Oh, and it feels so good. So that is aromatically. When you breathe it in aromatically, it's going through your nasal passageway directly into the limbic system of the brain, which directly affects emotions, um, happy, sad, all of that kind of stuff. It has a major, major function. The second way is you can apply them topically. So topically, like I did in my hands, you can rub it around. Um, I like to put it behind my ears, on my temples, the back of my neck. Um, one extremely effective way is just applying to the bottoms of your feet. The bottoms of our feet are like a map to our whole body. So there's something called Vitaflex and you can Google it or look up pictures, but it shows how the bottom of our feet or even our hands and the edges of our ears are actually a map to different things in our system. So when applying essential oils to those areas, it can actually directly affect those areas of the body. The navel inside your belly button is another excellent way to apply essential oils. That's where the umbilical cord would have been attached and it goes directly into your bloodstream, so it is an excellent way to carry essential oils into the body. So the third way of using essential oils is ingesting. So it's taking an essential oil, popping it underneath the tongue, adding it to your water, like I did here with these Vitality Drops, there's essential oils in here, and then drinking it. It's going straight through your system, those essential oils are being absorbed into your cells, so there's lots of different ways that you can use essential oils. But we are specifically sharing about Young Living, and there is a lot of reasons why, but the biggest is the quality. Young Living guarantees 100% pure therapeutic grade essential oils from carefully identified plants. Um, they practice what's called seed to seal, and seed to seal guarantees that through the seed that goes in the ground, the cultivation, the distillation, which is a huge science to know the proper way of doing that, the testing internally and externally, and then obviously sealing it and sending it straight to your door. 
not only pure, but tested for ther therapeutic properties, which is really, really important. Cheap and synthetic or diluted oils can be potentially toxic to the body. So it's really important to have a very high grade essential oil and to be with a company that knows what they're doing. And Young Living monitors every single part of that. They're not just a company that has a couple essential oil products that they're buying from some random person that was distilled by somebody else and bottled by somebody else. So there's so many ways that things can get, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Not just diluted, but tampered with. And maybe it's not intentionally, but you just never know. So it's best to have the highest quality product. Um, as I mentioned before, they're the single largest essential oil producer in the world. Um, they have therapeutic oils, which means it gives a therapeutic benef benefit to the body. Um, they have thousands of acres of aromatic farmland all over the world um, where it's properly grown, harvested, distilled, all of that. Um, and you really do get what you pay for. So the process of distilling is a science. You have to know how to do it, the right temperature, pressure, time of year, all of that to make it um, the best quality for you. So if you're brand new to essential oils or brand new to all of this, and this is kind of your first call or first time kind of learning about it, the best way to get started is with the Everyday Oils, which is in this premium starter kit. So we're gonna talk about a few in this kit to start. Um, this is where you would wanna get started. So I'm gonna talk about a lot of different things, but the coolest thing is that um, you don't have to buy a whole bunch of this stuff in order to get the results that you need. So a lot of times you can just put into practice what you have in your starter kit and have massive benefits. 95% of our daily needs come in this beautiful starter kit. Um, I have them in my purse, my bathroom, my car, all over the house, like literally everywhere. And I always go back to the oils in this kit because they are just so powerful and they can help with so many different things. Okay, so the first one I'm gonna share tonight from this kit, there's 11 oils in this kit. I'm just gonna share a couple. The first is called frankincense. This is like the king of all oils. It's my absolute favorite. You can actually put a drop, drop under your tongue to combat anxiety, stress, nervousness. It's really good to calm emotions. It's great on the face and the skin. I'm gonna put some under my tongue right now. Mm -hmm. Has a woodsy taste, mm. but it's good. It's very high in oxygenating compounds that oxygenate the area of the brain responsible for hormone, hormone production and regulating our mood. It's really good to help uplift, to keep you positive. So this is hands down an amazing oil to have. I always have one beside my bed, in the kitchen and in my purse. Like I do not go without this wonderful oil. The next up is Copaiba. Copaiba has the same compound as CBD. It's called beta carolotholine. It's a mouthful, but it's known to calm the body. It can help with an anti-anxiety kind of effect. So this also can be really great to be applied under the tongue. It's also a great for inflammation. So you can apply it all over the body to help with inflammation. You can apply it kind of, there's like an inch above the ear. There's almost like a little, so up in here, you'll feel there's a little bit of a bump. You can apply essential oils just above there and it's a great place to absorb right into the brain. Um, you can inhale it, you can apply it to your body, under your tongue. It's great added to your Ningxia Red or your water. I absolutely love Copaiba. The next one from the starter kit is lavender. Lavender is commonly known to be super relaxing. It's great for kids. It's great for, you know, that time that you need to wind down. It's very high in a compound um, ester. And esters help with the sedation kind of feeling. So that's why it's really good for sleeping or to relax and calm the body. 
It helps combat that busy, stressful feeling, like when your brain is just kind of crazy with so many things to do. And excellent for little ones. The next oil I'm going to share is kind of the bonus oil in this kit. It's called Northern Lights Black Spruce. Mm, it smells so good. I diffuse this one a lot. It's very grounding, very relaxing. Any tree oil, if you always think tree oils and calming, grounding, relaxing, all of them work in that way. Men love it. It's excellent diffused. You can mix it with different things um, and really good in a warm bathtub with Epsom salts. And then the last one that I'm going to share out of the kit for emotions is lemon essential oil. And lemon is an excellent oil. All citrus oils, so lemon, orange, tangerine, yuzu, um, grapefruit, bergamot, they're all citrus oils. And citrus oils are all very uplifting. They're a fresh scent. They invigorate the mind. Um, it's been said, like, when you smell a citrus oil, you can't help but smile, which is so true. It just smells so beautiful. Like there's just something about citrus. It also helps to purify the air. So if you're diffusing it, it can boost your immune system. So not only does it help with emotions, it can help with a lot of other things. Um, it's also super cost effective. So citrus oils, um, all citrus fruit is readily available. It's easy to diffuse. Um, uh, or sorry, easy to distill because there's lots of it. So it's great for diffusing because the cost is quite low. And it's also great to add to your water to help to detox the body. And then lastly, I forgot about this one. It's not a massive necessarily emotional oil, but for me, I find it helps a lot. And that's peppermint. Peppermint essential oil is just one of those ones that's great for a mental pick-me-up. So I find like if I'm stressed or if I'm emotional or any of those kinds of things, even just using the littlest bit of peppermint kind of wakes me up, invigorates my brain, and can help move on with the rest of the day. So this one's great. Just inhaled. You can diffuse it. I love to apply it to my temples or the back of my neck. Cools me off. Makes me feel wonderful. So those are a couple of the essential oils in the premium starter kit. So it comes with 11 oils and you get some extra goodies here in the bottom of the box. Some nature red, a hand sanitizer. Um, if you're new to oils, this is hands down the best way to start because these oils cover so many things that we deal with on a day to day basis. Um, the great thing is, is right now, if you are brand new, or if you're using oils and you just want to get yourself um, an additional starter kit, these starter kits are a killer price originally at $199.75. It comes with everything in that little kit plus this diffuser here. It's only $199.75. Like it is a steal of a deal. Um, it's over $400 worth of products for $199. But even better is right now until the end of February, this starter kit is 15% off. I have never, ever seen it be 15% off um, ever. And I've used Young Living for over eight years. And so $169 and you get all of those goodies. Um, also, if you join the loyalty program for the first month, which is called Essential Rewards, it's your best way to get your product. You also get a concentrated thieves cleaner, which is the best cleaner I've ever used. I'm sure I say that word the best way too much, um, but it's so true. You can clean your car, your pets, your counters, your toilets, like literally everything with this cleaner and it's safe, it's effective, and it's amazing. So if you're brand new, that's the best way to get started. If you join tonight, I will definitely send me a private message. I will send you a gift in the mail. Um, the purpose of this group is whoever invited you, you want to connect with them to get yourself enrolled and referred by that person. So if you reach out to me, I can always connect you back with the person that invited you to make sure that you get enrolled with the right person. But you definitely want to start that way because it is the best way. So we are going to get into a bit more of this feelings kit, a little bit more about emotions and this beautiful gem here. 
But first, I want to give you a little bit more information about emotions and how they work in the system. So the sense of smell is super powerful. It can remind us of the good things, the bad Okay, we're back. I had a connection issue. So, okay, like I was saying, you can help with many things in our lives. So good things, bad things, emotions can bring up a lot of stuff. But the reason why our emotions are triggered by the sense of smell is because the sense of smell is so great. And like I mentioned earlier, is it goes directly to the brain, um, to that limbic system. Another cool thing is that the molecules of essential oils are so small and they're small enough to enter and cross the human tissue, bringing nutrients to the cells and bringing waste and toxins out of the cells. This is super powerful. They also can carry electrons, which is energy, oxygen into our body. They carry coded information that can be translated into cellular DNA. It's beneficial for um, therapeutically for physical, mental, and emotional aspects of our body. There's hundreds and thousands of compounds in each oil. I mentioned that earlier, which is super important that we um, steward and bring out those compounds properly so that we have the whole chemical profile of each essential oil. The molecules in essential oils work like enzymes or vitamins and they carry pertinent information into our cells, which means that they'll be able to be used in parts of the body that actually need to use them. So for example, some oils gravitate towards tissues, while other oils will gravitate towards nerves or the digestive system. Others might gravitate towards the brain, just depends on what area of the body that specifically needs to support. So each is administering benefits to the body, also removing toxins and opening up memory stored in our DNA. So that's crazy. Oils can remove cellular memory stored anywhere in the body. Just think about that for a second. Oils can remove cellular memory stored in the body. So that means they can remove bad emotions. It also stimulates that limbic system. So the center of the limbic system is the amygdala, which stores our trauma, anger. It also stores joy, a lot of those things. Um, our ears, eyes, and tongue are also wired as messages to pass through to the brain. So smelling an aroma is more of an emotional response rather than a logical response. The emotions bypass our reasoning, and this is why when we have emotions, we're not always rational. <laughs> I don't know if you're with me, but some...